What's going on guys, War Joe here bringing you another review video. Today we have the uh, the very first video uh, that I had posted in a while uh, was for my Princess Leia unboxing. So today we're actually going to do a full in-depth review of the Princess Leia uh, lightsaber. Uh, I did get this recently installed, so we're going to go ahead and take a look at everything there. So starting out with the hilt, uh, the hilt was purchased from uh, Custom Dark Wolf Saber. Uh, they did have a recent run of this, so uh, I did purchase that from them. Uh, so this is the Leia lightsaber, so we'll just go ahead and get a close up there. It is definitely a cool looking saber. You definitely feel the quality there. Um, it's not really a bronze color to it. It's more of a type of rose gold to it. Um, it does have two activation switch. It has the activation switch right here. And then let's see if I can try and get that in there. A second one right here as well so if you do do uh, like CFX or something like that that does do uh, two buttons uh, then you can go ahead and use that as well or if you don't want to use the primary switch you can make the secondary switch right here um, your ignition switch uh, I did go with a nano biscotti v4 uh, install so I do have the primary button here as um, as my ignition switch and my power off switch. Uh, the install was done by uh, Albert Flores of uh, Smuggler's Outpost Shop uh, from their Etsy page. Um, so I will have his shop, uh, his Facebook page and all that uh, down in the description if you do want to go check it out. He does offer the chassis uh, on his Etsy page and then if you do message him uh, he can also go ahead and do the install as well uh, I did opt with a inhalt uh, tricree LED it does have a blue LED in there uh, and then we'll go ahead and open this up to show off the chassis so this is a custom chassis that was made by him so we'll go ahead and show that off there uh, I definitely like this little addition that he put here of the Arabush uh, language. Uh, it does come with a 18650 battery. Um, it does come with a bass speaker as well, and then the SD card, and then the Nano Biscotti V4 um, sound card. So it is definitely a cool looking chassis for sure. So I'm gonna go ahead and close this up here. So it does come, yeah, he did have three sound fonts already preloaded into this. Uh, I did actually customize it with some different sound fonts. Um, I did put one of the sound fonts is called Daddy Issues. Uh, another one is First Steps. And then one that already came uh, pre-installed was Dark Meat. And I did change the boot sound font uh, with uh, two quotes from Star Wars. Uh, both Princess Leia themed and then third is the Princess Leia uh, song uh, Just because you know, I figured it's the Leia Hilt. You got to have uh, Some Princess Leia just in memory of uh, Carrie Fisher there. So uh, Definitely a cool install there. It does also come with a retention screw in there Let's See if I can get that cleared There we go. So it does come with the retention screw. It is a one inch uh, blade holder. Uh, not a lot of room in there. Uh, unfortunately, it is a thin neck. Uh, so there is, I believe, uh, 0.75 uh, inches uh, for a blade to fit in there. Uh, so not really meant for um, dueling per se, um, but definitely a cool looking hilt. So we'll go ahead and fire this up, show you the different sound fonts, and just show you what this thing looks like uh, lit up. So go ahead and move my chair back here. So the first sound font I have on there, let me actually just go ahead and screw this in so the blade doesn't come out. Uh, 
So the first sound font in there is Daddy Issues. So we'll go ahead and fire this up and we'll go ahead and hear that first sound font there. May the force be with you. So it's obviously uh, Leia saying, may the force be with you. So here it is here. It has a flash on clash, uh, blue, blue, white. So, but definitely a cool looking saber there. Um, so there it is there, lit up. I do like that it kind of has like a little bit of window there so you can see the light in there as well. So we'll go ahead and power that off. And then we'll go on to the second one. This is, uh, so actually I just realized that was, uh, I believe actually that was first steps for the sound font. Um, but with the custom boot sound font, I believe the second one is daddy issues actually. Obviously, I had to go with that uh, quote. Definitely a funny one there. So we'll go ahead and fire it up. I do like how intense that's, that boot on is. Let's go ahead and play that again there. So it is definitely a more intense sound font. Uh, I figure she's kind of yelling, so uh, it'd be smart to put in like kind of like something with more bass to it there. So it definitely sounds cool. And then we'll go ahead and power that off. And we'll go on to the final sound font. Uh, this final sound font is Dark Meat, I believe. And then obviously you have there the, the original uh, soundtrack there. So we'll go ahead and fire this up. So definitely a cool uh, saber there for sure. And then we'll just go back to that primary. May the force be with you. So like I said, definitely a cool saber there. Um, this is the Princess Leia saber um, done by, uh, I got that from Custom Dark Wolf Saber and then the custom chassis and the install done by uh, Smuggler's Outpost Shop. Outpost Shop. Um, definitely happy with it this is definitely just a beauty to have in the hands um but that's it for the video guys if you did like that go ahead and leave a like uh subscribe for even more content as well um i am planning on doing a review for um the kyojin from the pack store just going more in depth on that um since my unboxing uh, and then as well, I did just get a Star Killer hilt in the mail, so I will um, be doing a review video on that. That one was already installed. Uh, I did get offhand, but I did just want to go ahead and show that off as well. Um, as well, if you, uh, I have some Marvel um, collectibles that I did want to do some review videos on as well. So if you did want to go ahead and see that, uh, let me know in the comments below uh, just to kind of add some more um, different type of content to my channel. Uh, so if you do find that interesting, uh, like, I had, like I said, just go ahead and comment. Uh, links to the uh, Custom Dark Wolf Saber Facebook page will be in the description as well as Albert Flores's or Smuggler's Output Shop, Outpost Shop uh, down in the description below. Uh, so go ahead and check that out as well. Go ahead and check out my other videos. And once again, have a good day.